So hi everybody, I am here with Mary and today we're gonna go over Palms of Saranoa. And you guys know the drill. We're gonna sort of look at the overview of the area. We're gonna talk about the community itself, how many homes, what style home they have, um, type of amenities, and we're gonna kind of pull through and see those amenities as well as prices. So we've got HOAs and then also the sort of pricing of the homes. Okay, so Palm to Saranoa is located in the Sawgrass development. It's in south, the most south area of Claremont, 34714. It is a, Palm to Saranoa is a small community within the Sawgrass development off Highway 27 with two entrances south and then a little bit north. Mm -hmm. And as far as the location, then it's really central and easy to get to the parks and stuff and hospitals, medical houses. Exactly. Picture a map and tell us what's around there. So Restaurants. Palms of Saranoa is about 15 minutes south of Claremont, where Claremont and Highway 50 meet. So you are have quick access to all the hospitals, the shopping, the Lake Louisa is right down the street, Lake Mineola, the parks. And then on the other side, you can go to all the Disney parks, to I-4 to take you to the airport, uh, the beaches. I mean, it's a very, very good location. Very good. Yeah. And I, certainly one of the special things is the parks location. And then, and as far as the hospitals go, of course, South Lake Hospital in Claremont is a newer hospital. It is. But they've also got a new hospital down there by 192. They have a number of new ER hospitals around. So it's it's in a great location for healthcare. Yeah, healthcare, and that's very important, obviously, to everybody, but mostly to the 55 plus. So you do have the South Lake Hospital, all the specialists, every kind of IS, IST, you, know. <laughs> you have the National Training Center there as well, um, and also you have, if you go a little bit further south, you do have, I believe it's the Orlando Health Hospital, mm -hmm. just on the other direction. Uh, if you go south, you have a hospital, and of course, if you go north, you've got Claremont and everything you really need. Well, and then the, the location, you mentioned the lakes and Lake Louisa, which is a fantastic Which is right down, park. it's right down the street, you can do all your, you know, they have the lake, you can hike, and then of course you can go a little bit up to Claremont and you can pick up the West Orange Lake County South Lake Trail, trail or you can go and enjoy the day downtown Claremont with Lake Mineola. I mean, there's just, you will not get bored there. There's something to do any location, any direction you go. Yes. So, so Mary, tell us the um, community information, builder, number of homes, that kind of thing. Okay, so DR Horton, the Freedom Homes, is the builder. When they are uh, the completion of the community, there will be, I think, 552 homes. They have um, a single family homes. I believe they have about five different floor plans, but they also have a duplex floor plan. And they start, I believe, at 1,600 square feet for the duplex I, and over, I think, just over 2,000 for the larger homes. They start in the high 200s to, for the duplexes and then they go up to the high 300s for the single family homes. So what would be the high price? What would somebody expect to be the highest price you might pay for a home? Well, depending on the lot, obviously, and the size of the home, you're gonna be in the high 300s. So that's a pretty, pretty solid group of prices. Do you wanna explain who, you know, as Freedom Homes, D.R. Horton, it's a production builder. It is a production builder and, you know, it really makes things easier for people when they go to choose their finishes. So you've got packages, but they have, their designers have done a fantastic job on all the finishes to the counters, the flooring, uh, the cabinets. So it really is just, it makes it stress free for the most part. And more affordable. And more because affordable. when you don't have the customization, you're not adding all the bells and whistles to create a, a price tag. Nickel and that might, yeah. right. Now, they must have different prices for lots and that might give you a variation of They price. do, they do have lot premiums because they do have conservation lots, they have uh, waterfront lots. So that is going to be, besides obviously the size of the home, that's gonna increase your price point but you will have the lot premiums depending on the location. Very it's nice. It's a beautiful community. They've really done a very good job carving that little area out. And it is gated. It's not guard gated, but it is gated. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. which is 
And then the HOAs, because there is a CDD in that community because it's got a shared entry road and, and so infrastructure of the shared areas on a CDD. Right. Do you know what that is by chance? Well, the CDD is on your annual tax bill mm -hmm. and it does range from the duplex lot, the 40 foot and 50 foot. But with both the CDD and the HOA, the monthly cost average will be 270 for the duplex all the way up to about 290 for the 50 foot lot. That's pretty reasonable. It, I mean, it is because it really takes care of the CDD does take care of the lighting, the infrastructure, the retention ponds, the roads, and then the HOA takes care of, obviously you have the amenities, you have your lawn maintenance, they have two dog parks. So, you know, all that mm -hmm. costs and it's, it, it, the money really is contributing to, you know, the beauty of the community. Mm -hmm. And so then really your only other costs would be your utilities and then cable, right. internet, right. things like that. Right. Exactly. We the have it HOA the by itself, um, I believe that's like between 168 to 190, and then the other half's going to be the CDD. But the if you do it a monthly cost bill, you know, basis, it's going to be 270 to 290. All right. So with regards to the amenities, well, it's beautiful. Now, of course, you know, Palm Saranoa is more of a boutique size community. Mm -hmm. You know, that's usually, I think, 500 to 600 homes. So the clubhouse is 5,000 square feet, but it's beautiful. It has a zero entry pool. It's got a sunshade over one section of the pool if you don't want to get sun. It's got pickleball courts, beautiful fitness center and aerobics room. It's got multi-purpose rooms, a small movie theater, and it's just very, very well appointed. And um, it's, it's just perfect for the size of community. Yep, and you mentioned a couple of dog parks. And You've got two dog to take parks, your, yeah. yes. <laughs> yes, very nice dog parks, which, you know, a lot of dog lovers, animal lovers. So you've sold homes in there. Mm -hmm. What other questions do you have? I know, I know a biggie I have gotten and most of our customers always bring up is, are fencing. you allowed fencing? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Sorry. You knew that. Yes, <laughs> because that is one of the biggest questions I get. And a lot of communities, actually most communities do not allow it. And they do allow it, and it's, I believe, a black wrought iron fencing mm -hmm. is allowed. Very nice. So that is actually a very positive thing that they're doing that. What else do they ask you? Frequently asked not questions. And it, no, it's not a gas community. No, no gas. As far as they ask me, obviously locations, how close is it to the airport? And it's probably about 40 minutes to the airport if you take, um, to Highway 27 to I-4, or you can get on 50, pick up the Turnpike. So it's about 40 minutes. They asked me about how close it is to the Disney parks. Another maybe 30 minutes. Mm -hmm. So it, the location is you can get, really, if you get Highway 27 right now, they're proposing a possible other road that's gonna cut through, but we still don't have information on that. Mm -hmm. But it is uh, access to everything you need. Very nice. All right, well, I think that covers Palms of Saranoa. J. Michael, you're behind the camera today. Anything you can remember? We did a good job. I like it. We got a thumbs up. <laughs> All right, well, you guys know that if you want to get connected with Mary and get some more information about Palms of Saranoa, you can call us, email us, click on Explore 55 Plus, hit Communities, go to the Palms, and send us a contact. There's more to explore. There's more to explore. There's always more to explore. <laughs> At the beginning of all our things, we used to sing it. We I'm haven't done singing. that for a while. Let's hear it. No, you don't want to hear that. You should hear J. Michael. He, he really might not get too many it. views. <laughs>